I am Dr. Srikant Shetty, Senior Consultant and Head of Cardiology at Sakra World Hospital. We often get uh, patients with lipid profile reports which are very extensive, including parameters such as lipoprotein small a, which is seen to be elevated and they are very concerned about it. Do we really need to worry about an elevated lipoprotein A? And how does it impact our heart health? And what can we do to control lipoprotein small a? Lipoprotein small a is a kind of a lipid that is present in the blood normally. However, in Indians and South Asians in general, a large proportion of our population is found to have extremely elevated lipoprotein A levels. This increases our predilection to heart attacks and strokes at a very young age. This is seen in other racial groups as well, but it's a bigger problem for South Asians. This is one of the explanations given as to why South Asians in general and Indians in particular are so predisposed to coronary atherosclerosis. Lipoprotein small a also affects the peripheral blood vessels, blood vessels of the brain and also increases the tendency for developing aortic stenosis that is narrowing of the aortic valve. While we know that an elevated lipoprotein small a that is a, above 50 mg per deciliter increases the risk of heart attacks it is not very clearly known as to how to reduce the lipoprotein small a levels. Drugs like fibrates and niacin had been earlier used to reduce lipoprotein small a, however, were not found to be significantly impactful on the outcome such as heart attacks. So now it has been concluded that if a person has an elevated lipoprotein small a, he or she should aggressively work on other coronary risk factors such as LDL cholesterol. So, if you have an elevated lipoprotein small a, the best you can do is to aggressively reduce your LDL cholesterol to levels below 100 so that your cumulative risk of heart disease and stroke significantly reduces. In patients who have familial hypercholesterolemia and have history of premature coronary artery disease in the family, aggressive use of statins or PCSK9 inhibitors reduces LDL cholesterol levels to an extent that the impact of lipoprotein small a on the blood vessels can be minimized. People who have elevated lipoprotein small a should follow a very healthy lifestyle including regular exercises, maintaining ideal body weight, reducing fat intake in the food, cutting down on carbohydrates and so on and so forth because these will reduce LDL cholesterol as well. Thank you.